Hello everyone and welcome back again to Onhow channel. My name is Enes and I'm working for you. So if you have any questions or any video requests, make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I do reply to each comment as well as messages on my Instagram and if you are wondering why is that because simply I'm working for you and in this video I will show you how to add order tracking page on Shopify for free because there is actually multiple ways you can do that the first one which is by using the apps on Shopify store and those apps will have only limited number of orders per month so if you got more than 50 or 100 order per month you need to upgrade your account to a premium plan however the second trick that I will show you in this video which is completely standalone without using any apps and you will be able to add your own order tracking page so your customers can actually access your Shopify store and just from your Shopify store they can track their order and the page will be really simple nothing fancy at all and if you know how to customize HTML and so on you can actually make it very good looking and so on and customizable for your Shopify store and the colors and everything else and the script that we'll be using in this video uses actually the 17 track platform and as I said we will not use any Shopify apps or anything like that I will provide you with the code and I will explain everything in this video you just have to copy it and paste it where I'm going to show you. And without any more talking, let's just jump to it. As you can see, I'm accessing the Shopify dashboard because that's basically what we'll be using to create the page, then sync it with the notification email that the customer will be receiving when ordering from your Shopify store. So the first step we need to do is creating the page, which is the order tracking page. And to do that, simply head over to the online store right here from the left menu click on it and after that click on pages and it will show you the pages that's currently on your Shopify store and simply click on add page right here and in here we need to paste in a code but before we do that make sure to click on show HTML in here and this is really important make sure you do that so Shopify dashboard will read the text in here as a code not as a, a regular text and just click on it and after that scroll down the description of this video and you will see a link and make sure to click it and it will send you to this page right here and in here you will need to copy the first call right here this is for the tracking page as you can see it says here tracking page script so just copy it from in here until the end of the script right here let's just right click and copy and get back to the page and paste it in here and the next step obviously is naming the page and the page will be order tracking so let's just type in here order tracking and once you did paste in the code in here as well as naming the page after that click on save right here or at the bottom right corner right here and the page will be saved and here is how your page will look like so in here the customer needs to type in the tracking number and he clicks on track then he will get a page it will display the product if it's shipped or not yet or whatever the case is the next step as I said is we need to sync in the email that the customer will receive with this page right here and by the way let's just open up the page to see it and here it is as you can see this is how the page looks like and I will also show you how to add it to the menu in here and I will do that actually first then I will show you how to sync the email for the shipment so let's just get back to the dashboard and in here after that head over to navigation click on it and after that click on main menu right here and click on add menu item and after that will show you this page on the right and simply click on the search or paste link in here and it will show you these options and click on pages and after that it will show you the pages that's available on your Shopify store and we did create order tracking right so make sure you do select the order tracking option in here and after that click on add at the bottom right corner and click on save menu and let's just get back to the Shopify store and see if it's available or not and here it is as you can see this is the order tracking menu and if you accessing the home page you should see it right here and if you click on it and it will send you to the order tracking page and right now let's just get back to the next step as I said which is syncing the email for the shipment with this tracking page so let's just get back the first thing you're going to do is click on settings in here and after that head over to notifications and after that scroll down and look for shipping 
and here it is and click on shipping confirmation and it will show you your current email that the customer will receive once the order has been shipped and on the top right here you should see edit call simply click on edit call and it will show you the html code for the email and right now let's just get back to the page that I said we'll put the link for it in the description box and scroll down a little bit do not copy the first one the first one we did copy which is for the order tracking page we need to copy the one right here and this is really important I did mention this right here as you can see it says important change the page URL in the script and this is really important as I said so we're going to copy this code but make sure you do change the URL to your Shopify store which is this one right here here it is as you can see so it's clearly visible you don't have to be confused or anything like that so make sure you do, you do change this with the page that we did create and I will do that in this video so let's just copy it first let's just copy it from here to the bottom of the page and here it right, to the end of the HTML and right click copy I'm going to do that again just a habit so after that let's just get back to Shopify and simply uh, command A if you are on a Mac or if you are Windows control A and delete all the code in here after that simply paste in the code that we did copy from the page in the description box as I said so right now the next important step which is changing the URL for the page that we did create which is order tracking page so let's just scroll up a little bit and here it is so in here we need to remove this and paste in the order tracking page which is this one that we did create so simply right click let's just right click and copy it and let's just get back in here and select this and make sure you do not remove the quotation marks simply the URL between them and remove them and paste in the order tracking page in here as you can see and this is the last step in this video right now this you need simply to click on save and you can click on preview right here and it will show you your email how it look like and here is the email that your customer will be received once the product has been shipped to his address and as I said I will put the link for the code on everything in the description box and as I said again in the beginning of this video I'm working for you so if you have any questions or any issues make sure to drop them below in a comment or just check out my Instagram right here below me I don't reply to each comment and if you are wondering again why is that because simply I'm working for you otherwise I think my job is done for this video so thanks for watching catch you on the next one